What up, everybody? It's your boy, DJ Donnie G. Back at it again. Just showing you a couple things that I've just been messing with. I recently got a DDJ uh, 1000. Dope controller. Really dope. But I thought I'd see what happens if I hook it up with uh, the DJ app, you know, on the iOS Play Store. See what works, see what doesn't work, and show y'all. All right. I got it hooked up, you know. I'm in my bedroom, so, you know, here's the app. Got it loaded up. Let's go and play a dang thing. You know, turn that down a second. But, uh, scratching's okay. I got the scratching uh, parameters set in a DJ. There's a little thing where you could change the, the crossfader to more of like a scratch kind of thing. Uh, volumes work. And the cool thing is, uh, the pad effects. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. Uh, what else? These cues don't work. So, you can't really cue any of your songs or anything. And... I don't know. I can't. I haven't figured it out because no audio goes there. So what I had to do actually is had to get one of these cords. Was it a RCA to 3.5 millimeter? And I actually got it routed into my channel four over here. So that's where all the volume comes out. Is over here. But deck A is controlled by this line and the other is controlled by this channel but you know what's cool is this still works so that see I could scroll through you know let's see I'll just pick a there you go you know hit the button see so loaded right up hit play Not much of a scratcher, but uh, nothing shows up on the screen, so, eh. But I mean, for backup purposes, I think it'll work okay. And let's see, you know, let's go on this side, you know, scroll through. Let's see, some chili peppers. Load that bad boy. Switch hands, you know. The cut on is pretty good. See, just a little bit, just that little beep. <laughs> That's pretty good. Let's see. None of these filters here work. Oh, okay. Let's see what the noise does. Not much. Filter. Okay, so we got the filter works. Not trying to get cut, but yeah. Video worked out. Um, for a main DJ rig thing, I don't think I'd use it this way because you can't really hear. I mean, you could set cues and stuff, you know, but you can't really monitor what's going to come out before. But for a backup, things happen, crap hits a fan, or a random request where you don't want to do it on your laptop, pull it up that way, 
you know, you got Wi-Fi to your iPad or whatever, you know, works okay. All right, hopefully this helped. Peace out.